Hi, my name is Tony Carnavali at the Carnavali Gallery at the Caesars Palace Forum Shop location. And I'm here tonight with Jim Ludwig of Vegas PBS. We just completed a tremendous retrospective of our artist Rita Asfor. And the, Jim, this program was completed this time virtually. Uh, it was a little bit different format for, for me, what I've experienced in the gallery before, which is we've had live uh, cameras rolling in here numerous times in the past. So this one was interesting for me. Overall, how did you feel the event went, and do you feel that it was successful? I think the event went really well. Um, virtual is always a challenge when you have out there, but we have a phenomenal staff. Um, I can imagine the backbreaking of putting all 26 of these paintings up and everything else. And um, uh, virtual is a little bit of a challenge, but I, I think we covered most of it. Uh, one of the benefits of that is everything is now recorded so we can send use this recording for future events that are out there and um, again we can't thank the gallery enough for what they're doing with the 25 percent that they're doing what the ashford family is doing on top of that more than more than a half of any purchase that anybody makes in the month of september is going to go in rita's name to vegas pbs to support arts programming and we just can't thank you enough for that that's wonderful, Jim. I also want to thank uh, the behind the scenes group that, was, that worked directly with me in this. Uh, my videographer and still photographer, John Master Giacomo, Shan Olson, Christina Townsend, and Maria Laborn. I'm here with Mary Mazur of Vegas PBS. And Mary, we had a great evening tonight. We had a retrospective on one of my artists, Rita asked for, and in a sense, one of your artists too, because you folks have completed a uh, television segment on Rita's uh, artwork and her life in essence. So I just wanted to get your perspective on how you felt this evening and how we partnered together, how it went overall for you. Well, thank you so much for hosting us. You know, we did two documentaries on Rita and her artwork, and uh, you know, our our mission as a public media organization is to serve the local community. And we are so grateful to you for hosting us and celebrating this wonderful local artist, and enabling us to extend the impact of the work we do, not only to the local community, but here in your wonderful gallery, where the local community is national and international national and you have all sorts of amazing artwork in in addition to the marvelous Rita Ashford and we're just so grateful to you and your participation in the community. That's wonderful to hear. Thank you very much Mary. Okay, and now I'm here with Amber Asfor, Rita Asfor's daughter. And taking part in this retrospective as you did, which we're very grateful that you were able to join us, the retrospective that we did this evening was partnered with Vegas PBS. Overall, how did you feel the retrospective was presented and the format of the television program that we did? Uh, I'm just completely taken aback, so appreciative of all the hard work that everybody put into this, sure. um, especially the gallery here, you Tony, uh, for making such a beautiful display of the artwork and all the hard work that you know uh, Jim put in from PBS as well. I just thought it came together so well and so cohesively that I, I'm just very pleased. That's really nice to hear. I'm very happy to hear you say that because we wish, certainly we wish your mother would have been here with us. So having the mayor of Las Vegas, Mayor Carolyn Goodman, along with Mary Mazur, president of Vegas PBS in attendance, and you, of course, just really made the evening spectacular. So I want to thank you for being here and I look forward to a successful month of September where we continue to exhibit the work. Mm -hmm.